Hello everyone, welcome to the Michigan Referee Committee's weekly video. This week we're going to talk about Dagoso, or denial of an obvious goal scoring opportunity. When a Dagoso offense happens inside the penalty area, and if there is an attempt to play the ball, then the red card is downgraded to a yellow card. However, if there was no attempt to play the ball, or if the offense is handball, pulling, pushing, or holding, then the red card remains as a red card. So let's watch an example. It's an awkward ball in behind, and it goes being caught out here by Ajibani. He goes down, it's a penalty! And what colors the card? What colors the card? It's red. And this is disastrous. She just couldn't not touch her. 80 odd minutes, maybe. In this video, this is an obvious goal scoring opportunity. The play is headed to the goal. There's only the goalkeeper left. The distance to the goal is close. And the attacking player has control of the ball. Therefore, this meets the criteria for being an obvious goal scoring opportunity. Now let's think about the foul. What kind of foul is this? It is a tripping offense. It is not handball. It is not pulling, pushing, or holding. However, in this situation, the player simply tripped the opponent from behind. There was no attempt to play the ball. Therefore, even though the offense happened inside the penalty area, this red card cannot be downgraded to a yellow card. The referee's decision to award a red card for this dog's offense was a correct decision. Therefore, we must always remember that just because an offense is a trip doesn't mean the offense must be downgraded. Was there an attempt to play the ball? That is a critical question that we must ask ourselves before we determine the color of the card to drift.